Hey, this is Overpass Insights. My name is Eric and I make apps. Now today I want to talk about how most companies could use an app. Okay, so I'm coming to you today from Newbury on this beautiful sunny English day. So I was in Newbury this morning to go to a networking event. I've been doing a lot more of these networking events, trying to get better at being less of an introvert and getting out and meeting other companies, other businesses, and you know, networking. So, and I don't know whether or not it's going to help or not yet, but you know, I'm giving it a try and I'll let you guys know as things progress. But one of the things that's become clear to me while getting out and meeting other companies and talking to businesses large and small is that I've become increasingly convinced that every business would benefit from technology or an app. And that could be a mobile app or a web app, but technology is what everybody needs. And as the more businesses I talk to, I realize that they know that too. I mean, you know, every time you go into a restaurant or you go into a shop, you know, if these guys had a mobile app to work with, they could be far more efficient, right? They know it too. The only problems getting in their way are they can't afford it or they're looking for something off the shelf or sometimes they work with another developer and that developer was terrible. But it seems like all businesses realize that there's a need there, right? Large or small, even if it's part of a chain, they're realizing, yeah, if our employees had an app, they could do this. Or if our customers, if we had an app on the app store, our customers can, can do that, right? And when I say I'm an app developer and you know, your business can use an app, a lot of the times I can see what they're thinking, right? What they're thinking is I'm talking about games, right? I'm talking about rinky dink little games that go on the app store and nobody's gonna download them. And they start thinking, yeah, it's not really a priority for us. But if I start talking about improved processes, like, you know, keeping track of your employees when they clock in and clock out with their GPS coordinates or uh, you know, a barcode scanner where they could take stock and in inventory or you know, lots of different like practical applications which will help them reduce man hours, reduce a lot of the stuff they do, get more efficient, then that, that's when the eyes light up, right? A lot of the times the younger developers will ask me, should I learn Android in 2019? Should I learn iOS in 2019? Should I learn mobile app development? And the answer is yes, right? Because as app developers, we think a lot about the passive income and putting that hit app on the app store, right? Which hopefully will happen. Now, you should definitely have your own portfolio, put your own apps out there. But there's a lot of opportunity out there too. There's a lot of businesses that are gonna need you. And a lot of the times, it's easier to go from one language to another than it is to go from no languages to a language. So if you learn Android and for whatever reason, Android dies off, which is not gonna happen, but let's say it does, it would be easy to go from, from Java to C Sharp or Java to Node.js than it would be go from nothing to, to those technologies, right? There's a lot of opportunity out there. There's a lot of businesses, and I know because they've come up to talk to me and said, oh, you know what? So I go to these networking events and they'll come up and say, Actually, you know, this is something we could really use too. How much would it cost, right? And that's usually when I, when I lose them. Like a custom application is usually difficult. But a lot of times I can suggest something else that's already off the shelf. And a lot of times with these off the shelf uh, systems like CRMs and stuff, is they'll do like 80% of what they want, but not the 100%. So, and it's nice to work with, with companies where they, they have that vision of this is, these are all the great things we could do, right? For those of you guys who are app developers out there and you're worrying whether or not you're wasting your time, dude, there is so much opportunity out there. Just look around you, you'll see it everywhere. And um, it's definitely, you know, it's not too late to get into app development if you're, if you're on the fence about it. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Do you agree, disagree? Anyway, that's it for today. I'll talk to you guys again next time. Strong like a tree.